Vancouver-based Simon Fraser University are one of three Canadian bands who've made it into the Grade 1 Finals. And they're among about 50 bands from overseas who spend a lot of time, effort and, of course, money coming here for the championships. We caught up with Simon Fraser in Seattle as they made their final preparations at the Pacific Northwest Highland Games. And as you can see, I'm a bit of a fan. Simon Fraser was a Scottish explorer who came up the uh, west coast of North America and made a number of stops. When the university was formed 40 years ago, they elected to go with the name Simon Fraser University and they really wanted a pipe band to go with that to support the Scottish heritage. I just want you to know that I do not feel like Rod Stewart at the moment. It's like we sign a few, a few uh, CDs from time to time. A lot of people here have a big appetite for Scottish culture and they will sell a lot of CDs this weekend. The profits from that will be used to fund the band and get us to Scotland every year for the World Championships. And good luck in Glasgow. Yes. Now that would be a trip to take. We think that the World Championship in any field should be a world event and should travel from country to country. And those would certainly be Northern Ireland, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, and the United States. We're hoping that that will happen. We have one shot to come over on one day and try to play as best as we can. The first, the set is three minutes, about three minutes, and then the selection is five to seven minutes, and that's it. The whole year comes down to those two short performances. transition to the real. That part could have just been a little cleaner technically. Excellent support from the snare line throughout this reel. It's one of the strongest performances we've heard so far. We think we did pretty well. Quite happy with how we played. It's up to the judging gods. We did our bit. We did our best. Great to be here today.